was water whipping, when I was water whipping, when I was water whipping. What's going on guys? Hope you're all having an amazing day. It is another vlog. It is another trip to the thrift. I'm actually starting off my day. It's about 10.30. Gonna take Captain to the doggy spa. He's gonna get a nice bath. He's gonna get his nails clipped. He's gonna get the whole works. So I'm gonna drop him off while we hit up the thrift stores. I think I'm gonna hit up two Goodwills, one Salvation Army, and I'm actually gonna go to Plato's Closet. A couple people have been saying go to Plato's Closet. Now the only downside of Plato's Closet is I'm not to play music because they blare copyrighted music. So either there's a chance that there might not be playing music or I'm just gonna play music over it, but we will hit up Plato's Closet for you. And maybe I'll do a TJ Maxx or Ross, I don't know. Today's gonna be wild. Let's see what today has for you. Let's get it started and let's get it guys. I swear, Captain gets more excited when he comes here than when I bathe him at home. I just, I don't understand. He probably thinks he's at a dog park. By the way, guys, a few people have been asking me, Amelia, when are you gonna post another video on like old trips to the thrift? Guys, I post a video every single day, but YouTube has changed their policies. You don't only have to be subscribed, now you have to actually press the notification button to notify that I post a new video. So for everyone that is subscribed, just put on your notifications. You go to my profile and there should be like a little bell and you click that and every time I post a video, you'll be notified. Because a lot of people are like, Amelia, when are you posting another video? Are you doing a shoe collection? And yo, I posted a shoe collection like four days ago and I've been posting a video every day since. So like, I don't know if those people are just not looking or like I said, if you have to press the notifications. So everyone that subscribed, all like 1,400 of you or 1,500 of you, if you could press your notifications so that way you're notified as soon as I get a new video. But we are currently about to pull up to Goodwill. We're about a stoplight away. So let's hope they have some goodies. So we actually got lucky and didn't have to park handicapped today because we found a spot and we are at Goodwill Superstore. Let's get it. All right, so the first piece we find for today is this red windbreaker style with the gray Nike check. As you see, it is vintage tags. It is a size large, but it seems like it's, maybe this is a women's large, but this does seem small. I'm gonna try it on real fast to see, but it looks like it might be a women's large. So I just found this weekend shirt. If you notice, it's like a box logo style, and it is a size medium, so that is a cop. TH? No, not Tommy Hilfiger. We got the hundreds in a size medium. This shirt looks brand new. It looks like it was just printed yesterday. Flawless screening, so. I feel like this was a pretty nice piece. It's a Supreme Pinstripe, sorry, Supreme Superman Pinstripe. Got Superman on the back, number one. This is a size XL. I think I'm gonna cop this, but it looks like, yeah, it's a size XL for sure. I thought it was a kid's XL at first. Sad, dude. Sad. 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 So I know I said I don't cop 2XL, but I just found this LRG in like the codeine purple with all gold zippers. Like you got the zipper hood, all gold accents everywhere, gold on the back. Like this piece is just so nice. Alright, so we're leaving with the nice little bag and we are on to, I think we're going to go to Gout. I think we're going to go to another Goodwill. Usually I would go to Salvation Army because it is by my house. But since I'm going to Plato's Closet, that is by the Salvation. So we're going to the Goodwill. I got keys, keys, keys. Make a sex. Yo, if any of you guys follow DJ Khaled on Snapchat and saw him Snapchatting his baby being born while he was playing I Got the Keys. <laughs> Like, how do you play your songs while your baby's being born and Snapchatting? I mean, I guess it's cool for memories. It's like if I were to vlog it, 
but it's like to play your own song. I got the keys, keys, keys while your baby's being pushed out and your wife is like in excruciating pain and you're just jamming in the back, Snapchatting. But hey, DJ Khaled, he's a smart guy. He's making stupid money what he's doing and he's clearly the king of Snapchat overnight pretty much just by getting lost at sea so it's crazy we finally made it another packed parking lot though which means everyone and their mother is thrifting today let's see what they got So literally as soon as I got there, there were so many people in the men's section so I literally had to go as fast as I could, snatch and grab. There was other thrifters that were getting vintage that I wish I could have got. But guys, this is the most I have ever spent at the thrift store. This bag is completely filled. Like it's probably easily 15, 20 pounds. So we're gonna jump back home, show you guys what I got cause I got some fire. And by the way, I know I said I was gonna go to Salvation Army as well as another Plato's Closet and I only went to two Goodwills. But like I said, the amount of time that I just spent at this Goodwill and the amount of things that I just got cover like four trips to the thrift videos. So I already know this video is gonna be like 15, 20 minute long just to show you guys what I got. That's why I'm gonna go pick up Captain right now and then head back home so I can make the video for you guys and get all, hopefully get all this uploaded to the website. Wait guys, let me know down below in the comments. I'm thinking about giving you guys free shipping. I think what I'm gonna do is add the shipping cost into the product cost. Instead of having a base price of $7.50 for shipping, which some people love because they buy like five things and they only spend $7 on shipping, or some people hate it because they only get one thing and then they spend the $7 on shipping. So I think I might just give free shipping domestic now domestic that's united states for canada and overseas i'm still trying to figure out the cost uh, so just bear with me on that but for domestic inside the united states i think i'm just going to do free shipping and have the shipping already included into the price so i'll have like 20 dollars shirts and that's ship there's no there's no tax there's no nothing just 20 dollars, 10 dollars, 8 dollars, whatever the case may be so let me know in the comments if you guys think that's a good idea. If you guys think I should just continue with what I'm doing now and keep everything the same price. All right guys, quickly jumping back into it and we're just gonna get straight into it because there is a lot of heat. So this is gonna be from the last Goodwill. Like I said, I couldn't film in there. As soon as I got there, literally 20 people in the men's section going through everything. So I literally just grabbed and went. And then at the end, I picked out, okay, I want this, I want this. I was grabbing so many things, I didn't know what I was grabbing. But to start it off, I'm sure a lot of you guys have seen this colorway. Supreme actually made a box logo this colorway and it's going for like $500. But this is a vintage champion, as you can see a champion patch right there. And like the yellow, and like the yellow highlighter greenish color. And this is a size large. Most of these things I am gonna try to upload on my website. If there's anything you see that I didn't upload, send me a DM and I'll put it on the website so you can cop it instantly. Another size large, this is a starter New York Yankees with a huge Yankees embroidered. Got starter right there. Got a large Columbia. This material is very soft. It's like a 3 4 zip. It's like a mix with red. See pocket right there and then a Columbia patch right there. This piece I, I love. This is a size, well, there isn't a size on this piece, but I wanna say it's either XL, maybe double, but it's a jean vest and as you see a huge Mickey on the back and I realize it is reversible. So you could flip it inside out and then you have like this plaid material. As you can see right there, 
And then we have the Mickey on this side. This piece is very fire. Again, I'm not too sure the size here. I'll try it on. So I'm usually a large, so this is about a large, a large to XL. Um, it is kind of short, as you can see, this is a regular t-shirt, but it is baggy. So I'd say probably a large, maybe an XL. Everyone's asking for small t-shirts, so I did grab a couple. Got this hill figure, number eight, New York, and then some patches right there. This is a size small. If any of you guys have ever heard of the brand James Percy or Perse, I'm not really sure which name it is, but this is a very expensive brand. They sell this at like Nordstrom. So this is a four, which is a size large in the baby blue colorway. Cop this for personal, but it's like an oversized gray, it's like an oversized nude pocket tee. It's gonna be perfect for upcoming winter to layer stuff, so this is for personal. Got this vintage Nike, as you can see the vintage tag right there. Brazil soccer jersey. This seems like it's a medium. Um, it says five at the bottom, so I'm not sure if that's a size, but this piece is very nice. There's no size on it, but I'd say about a medium, maybe a medium large. Another vintage Calvin Klein, as you can see the tag right there. There's no branding, but I thought this shirt was really nice. It has like ripples all up on it. And like this red color, and like this red nude colorway. Why am I blurry? And like this red nude colorway. Again, small people. This is a small vintage Polo Ralph Lauren tag. We got the embroidered, this is all embroidered. This is a huge patch, American flag with the RL. Size XL, Detroit Red Wings with the all over print. Whoever is double XL, make sure you're paying attention on this video because I did get a lot of things for you. This is a vintage Nike, as you can see the vintage Nike tag again. Green shirt, but at the bottom it has Nike wrapping around the back. And this is a double XL. We got another Polo Ralph Lauren. Unfortunately, someone cut the tag size, which really sucks. I want to say this is a large, probably an XL, large to XL, in like the mint chocolate chip colorway with like the red burgundy, uh, it's like a pink horse, with like a pink horse. These were so fire when I found them. Got Tommy jeans right there, vintage Tommy Hill figure patch on the back. On the butt, you have Tommy Hill figure. Black jean shorts. These are a size 34, so if anyone's a 34, give me a shout out. I do have a couple more uh, Tommy Hilfiger jeans, shorts, as well as long pants that I just haven't put on the website. So if you guys are looking for these, hit me up and I will send you pictures of what I have. So these next four pieces, I really found them as I was walking out of the thrift store. And again, I don't usually buy 2XL, but a couple people have been asking me for 2XLs. So this is 2XL, 100% all for you. We got the Polo Ralph Lauren and the vintage tags. All of these must have been donated by the same person because they're the same style. But if you notice, we have a Polo Ralph Lauren Yacht Club patch on the sleeve. And then on the back, a huge flag patch. Again, all of these are about the same. It's like the same sailing club style. You have the big pony right there. Then another big pony. Patch on the side that says Patrol Coastal. And this is actually a 3X. So this is a 3XL. Another 3XL. Got the patch again. Got two patches. Polo Ralph Lauren with the Indian. The 2XL. Polo Ralph Lauren. Nice little patch right there. And then on the back we have number 16. I'll probably do those as a package deal. If someone is 2, 3XL, just send me again a DM at DITR954 on Instagram and I'll do a little package deal and have you all those shipped out to you. If anyone's a 2 or 3XL that just wants to buy one of them, again, shoot me a DM and I'll get them to you. That's it for bag number one. Jumping into bag number two, their vintage Nike tag. This says size large, which I realize it's a boy size large, but actually trying it on, it's definitely a boy small. So we have a boy small red with a gray Nike windbreaker, and this does have a zippable hood that is pulled out at the moment, but you could just tuck it in. 
very nice windbreaker. Someone said, why don't I get a small and windbreaker? There you go, guy. 2XL, LRG with the coating purple and gold all over. If you notice, it has a zip up hood, gold, gold pocket. There's just everything purple and gold. This jacket is too fly. This is pretty unique. We got a Superman pinstripe jersey, brand new with tags. On the back, it says Superman number one. This is a size XL. Size medium, we have the hundreds in like this red and green Christmas colorway. You have a big TH. Then the hundreds logo right there. The final pickup for today, we have another size medium, the weekend in like this box logo style. And this is legit merch. It's not just print as you can see, XO. Wraps up today's trip to the thrift. And I am gonna try to upload as much as I can on my website before this video airs. But if for some reason there's something that you see either in this video or in any of my videos that you don't see that isn't sold out, just shoot me a DM, say, hey Emilio, can I get this? Put it on my website and you can buy it right there. Huge thank you to everyone that is ordering. Appreciate you guys so much. I have been a little busy this weekend and then today was a little hectic with running around and getting captain and all that. So I am shipping out every single order tomorrow morning as well as whoever orders tonight and upwards to tomorrow morning till I go to the post office, you will get your order. And I do two day shipping with everything so you should get it by tomorrow, Tuesday. So you should get it by Thursday at the latest. Um, and again, let me know down below in the comments if I should do free shipping and if I should just include the shipping price with the t-shirt or whatever the item may be instead of having shipping. Now that's for domestic, for international Canada, like I said, I am trying to figure out the correct shipping costs. Some things are under what I have it, some things are way over than I have it and people aren't paying enough. So I really have to figure that out. You check out my website, link down below. Today is the last day you can use the 15% off discount code, so make sure you take out those orders. If you didn't check out my last two videos of me climbing a crane, make sure you go check those out, it's pretty cool. facing fears, climbing heights, it's just, it's crazy, it's crazy, you guys gotta check it out. So hope you guys come back tomorrow for another EMC vlog, and don't forget, let's get it, 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 guys. When I was water whipping, when I was water whipping, baby girl, where you was when I was water whipping, when I was water